Hi, welcome to Gaming Dreamer. Okay, just a uh, few days ago, I finished uh, Tales of Zestaria. I upload the last video yesterday. I mean this night, and uh, even that I have like things to plan for. Like right now, I'm playing The Last of Us. I have a paper here. Uh, I have uh, The Last of Us. I have one video, but I didn't include it. Uh, I mean, didn't edit it for uh, the channel yet. I am playing Rakken Zan Tales. Five uh, episodes so far in the channel. I need to play that more. Uh, it is a cool uh, RPG Maker game. And I'm playing Sinran Tagora, the new game. Uh, Stephazel. Uh, Versailles, uh, I I don't remember the sign on it. And I plan to play Digimon, but I'm waiting because uh, the plan is for me and my friend to start playing it together. I'm playing it for the channel, of course, and he'll play it normally. Don't, uh, don't ask. Uh, we did this before a few times with other games, like we start together and then, oh, this game, oh, we can hear it. Uh, stuff like that. So this is the four games I have in my channel right now, and maybe I will do more of the um, the looking at emulators game that's uh, hardly to find them. I don't know if I will do that more because mm, yeah. So this is not a collection video. This is uh, more of games I have. <coughs> Games I'm planning to play for the channel. I want to show them to to see if you if there are any games you want uh, more than the other. So I know what uh, game to play. Do not feel like oh just play the game you want. No, it's more like I want to play every game here. But uh, more of if you pick any game, I'm okay with it because every game here I want to play. So, further to do, I will start with my, I have the back here of uh, RPG games and here other games. <laughs> so, let's start. Uh, okay, do this. This is Persona 4 Golden for the BSTV. Uh, and you will know that uh, this is not my entire collection, but uh, I have uh, so many 3DS games. I think the system that I have most game for are 3DS, but I have no way to record from the 3DS, so no 3DS game in this uh, video. And because I have the Beast TV and still didn't use it to record anything, I am so hyped to do something about the Beast TV, Beast Vita games. And Persona is like the game I want to do the most. I play this game like I reach maybe, I don't know how many percent of the game because I never finished it before. But I think I finished like three dungeons so far. So, tell me if you want to, uh, me to play this. Second game, of course. This guy, a four. I didn't have the chance to play it for the BS3, and this is like the better version. Like, uh, they added stuff and stuff like that. Neat. I still didn't play this guy, five. The PS4. I was planning to do it, but uh, my friend wants to play Digimon, so yeah, let's play Digimon. Freedom War. I finished this game and it is fucking awesome. I love it. And I would love to play it again because, like, play it on big screen would be much better. And uh, the other thing is, like, uh, what can I say? It is a game that. Uh, at the end, I start to understand more strategy to it, so. It's kind of game that if you play it once, it's okay, but second time, it's like, yeah, I can ace it. I can speedrun it or do more awesome stuff to it. So, this is will not be blind, but it will be awesome. And there are so many missions I didn't finish it for the game. Like, there are this last secret dragon or something. Okay, what we I have here is something very special. Very, very special. I am considering myself self very very lucky to get this three games not one 
the last story for the week. Pandora and the start of the show, Xenoblade Chronicle. I get this for like not that very very great price, but good price, and I consider myself very very lucky to uh, get them. Very very lucky because this is like one of the rarest uh, Wii games that I want. There are a few other Wii games I still want to get, but. This is the most, and I have this RPG game called Arc Rise Fantasia. I don't have any idea about this, and I like the idea that I play something I don't know anything about because I like to surprise myself. This guy at three, someone really hate this copy. I get it uh, for cheap uh, in a retail shop and. Yeah, look at this, like, someone, someone have a fight with the game, it still work, but someone have a fight with the game, I probably will get the beta game because it have more, and it will be better to get this one, but, uh, this guy here will be a thing, new game, Zelda, uh, I have money problems this year so I didn't order so many games uh, this time but I plan to get uh, the Twilight Princess, uh, Chronicle X and a few other uh, Wii games that I won't get but the thing is I get more digital because I live in the Middle East and it is impossible to get uh, so many RPG games because they don't bring it there or and much if they bring it very much 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 expensive so downloading is a better option for me and but for the Wii U do not download games for the Wii U 32 gigabyte and I have the only option I have to use it is like to have a external higher hard drive with external power and both the wires and everything and wish that work it's like very very hard to download games on the Wii U. 32 gigabytes. What is 32 gigabytes? My phone have more than 32 gigabytes. Nintendo, fuck it up. If the Nintendo and X have like less than one terabyte, I will not buy this shit. Because out of there you can replace the hard disk or something. And I was lucky again. I get a game that is very hard to find. Xeno Saga. Xeno Saga 2. And guess what? Xeno Saga 3. Xeno uh, Saga 1 is very, very expensive if you get it from Amazon or any other shop. Anyway, I was lucky because in my country they don't understand. Uh, the rare games and stuff like that all games are same price this is why they are very expensive but in the same time all games that are rare they're cheap this is uh, the second time that happened to me I have a cave story 3 for 3DS the place they sell the 3DS games are very expensive like maybe one and a half time the price I can get it from Amazon if Amazon sells it for like uh, 40 bucks, I can get it from here like 60 or 65 bucks. Uh, with a you know, uh, uh, currency ex exchange and stuff like that. But KV Store is like $200 on Amazon when I check it out and like I wanted them. Wait a minute, this place has it. How much? Yeah, the same price as every other game. So I did it. <laughs> Was lucky. And the same thing happened with me with and Xeno Saga because it was very expensive on Amazon but it was the same price as every other game. Of course they didn't have one and two, I uh, two and three. So I have to get them from Amazon and thank God there was like cheaper and then I mean with the normal price because everyone get the first game but uh, and uh, when we play it, we will get two or three. 
and they never does so there are so many two and three available but number one is the expensive one now we go to not the geology and yeah this is a i mostly like the geology but i don't have thing like this one uh another vita game marmosa I played for the Wii a little bit a long time ago. But this game is like 2D and action game like Castlevania. But uh, with RPG on it, but I will not call it RPG. Uh, for me, RPG is about journey, going from place to place, explore the world, stuff like that. This is not uh, have that. I actually, I didn't play the game. And the Odin Sphere will be released this year, uh, released in Japan, but if it's released in English, it will be amazing. English has been international, I'm, English is not my first language, but come on. English would make uh, e e all the international players use English because their English uh, language is not available. Maybe five or six games I find with Arabic. Okay. The game I get with the system of the PlayStation 3, Infamous, I still never started. I don't know why, because uh, when you uh, get the game with the system, like, uh, it's a cheap game. But it's not, but still, like, yeah, I will play it later, 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 I never, later, never have it. Phantom Bay. This game is a victim for my little game, and... Then I start my Let's Play channel, and I was busy doing the Let's Play games, and this is, was not one of them, because I'm not very proud of my skills. My skills in this game is not that great. Actually, I don't know if I can even finish it, because I've had that skills in games like that, uh, you know, Resident Evil, uh, The Last of Us. The Last of Us, the first level, gave me so much uh, work, because I'm very, very bad at it. Uh, stealth <coughs> and you know adventure stuff like uh, Resident Evil, Metal Gear. I never finish any Metal Gear games. I it just uh, don't register with me so much. Sorry if I offend anyone of you who are a fan of uh, this game, but uh, I love the games. I just not good at them. You don't need to be good at something to love it. Speaking of not be good at what you love. Fighting games, Tekken, the tag tournament for the Wii U, and because what I'm planning to do with this game is, uh, you know, a guy named Northern Lion, who have like long series of uh, blind of eyes. I want to do something like that, like a series that's very very long that I will play forever or something like that, and I enjoy Tekken Five for this session have this uh, mode where you always fight and uh, evolve your players and make them strong and uh, <coughs> they can have uh, they can take them on it too have, have, have that they can six didn't have that I hate they can six because of the way you unlock things in the adventure game that's long and boring and takes so much time it's like very very annoying me uh, the, I hope the server didn't do that. The way I could do fighting games last time, like uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur Five. Soul Calibur Five was shit. They're like nothing in the game. People complain about Street Fighter Five have nothing. Well, actually, I think uh, Street Fighter Five had less than uh, Soul Calibur Five. Shit. And this one have a lot of content. Actually, it's just a bit better edition than the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360 because uh, you have uh, Nintendo customs and stuff like that. So it would be fun. I want to do something like Forever Game. At least one game that's like how I find the channel. Speaking of games that can find channels, Bayonetta. I started to play it. I started to play uh, this is of course uh, the Wii U version of Tap Bayonetta 1 and 2. One. Two. 
in another game I want to play. Speaking about games I'm not that good at, but I still want to play Mario 3D World. I reach the third or the fourth world and stuck. And maybe uh, one of the reasons I'm making this channel is because I need a motive to play the game day and day because I have this habit of playing the game, playing the game, and then when I reach the middle, it's like. Hey. But uh, actually, playing games on channel encourage you. So even that I don't have that much subscribers, I enjoying finishing games because that encourages me. Some people do vlogs, and that helps too. Another game, Donkey Kong Country for the Wii U. I never finished any Donkey Kong Country because I never had the SNES. I didn't have the uh, Nintendo 64, still wish I have Nintendo 64. Uh, there are like, I didn't have the GameCube. The first console I get to Nintendo after the uh, my Famicom, not any yes, I didn't have any yes, I have Famicom. It was the, the Wii. Still, that not many games because it was like used and not that uh, it doesn't work very well. So many games doesn't play very well. One of the reason I get the Wii U because I can play Wii games, so I can play Wii games that I didn't have a chance to play. And this is Super Mario Galaxy. Super Mario Galaxy. Do I have hard time on this too? Because not it was not available in my country. And the reason I get them because I was waiting the they release them in the Wii U uh, digital, but they and that will never happen. Guess what happened later? They release them. Just in this next week, I get them. They was released. Eh. Another game that's very hard. It's like Mario Maker but on drug. Uh, NES Remix Pack 1 of 2. I let uh, leave the game because ooh, very hard it's like uh, start game uh, very easy like walk from here to here oh, that will be easy then you get hard it's like there are three more you he jump together and finish the game it's like wow like a very very challenging very fun if you know the old game and you can introduce to older games Okay, we reached the end of the video because this is the final game. I tell you about Samurai Kagura will be on uh, the channel soon. Uh, once I edit out the full video that I recorded without <laughs> editing because I was having fun with the game. I mean, boobies, but even the bus chicken. I don't know if I will keep doing them because I hear that so many channels who upload this video get uh, like a strike because uh, because of uh, you know nudity, one of the channels that get del uh, deleted because of this game is the Marvelous Channel. Marvelous Channel is the channel of the uh, of the this. Oh, see, it is the company who make the game. They delete YouTube account of the company who make the game. <laughs> The company is they make the game. Okay, the last if uh, nothing wrong happens with Sunrise Kagura of the PS4, I will play the Vita game. It's, it's their version for the PS4 for this. Uh, I will do it, but the PS Vita. PS Vita, I never done anything to it on this channel so far, and I wish I do. But the quality seems okay. Not that good. Okay. If you think about it, the the screen of the PS Vita is here. This is the screen of the PS Vita. It's smaller. And then I watch it on my 50 inch TV. And it's still okay. Being okay after all that is great. Do not miss uh, the, the sterility and the, the power of the Vita. It is very strong system, just like not lucky. So 
I maybe make another video like that for the digital games that I have and I wish to make video about. But that will be harder because I have to go to the, uh, my base beta. Uh, how many system I own for that? I have the base beta, the PS4, uh, the Wii U. Mm. So yeah. The PS3 is more of a game that I have like I have games but you know uh, this piracy in the Middle East it is not it start to decline now but in the PS3 era is what we can hype now not on virus games but I guess still the people who try to price game but now it's less because uh, but then PS3 era it was like so many and yeah I maybe have 200-300 games on my PS3 hard drive. <laughs> I do not play Pirates game on this channel. <clears throat> but this is it. Of course I have so many Steam games. Uh, I have Origin. Uh, there are something I don't have on PC and I want to do is like get uh, the Star Craft 2 because I never get this game. I have it before, but pirates and it's like I have this whole like no piracy anymore, so I delete it and get rid of uh, every virus game I have in my PC and just become straight for uh, original games. So I play Star Craft 2 a little bit, but then. Uh -uh -uh. No, no more. The thing about StarCraft, you know how convenient it is to just download the games from the Steam uh, app you have, which is Steam. In Steam, I like, oh yeah, this game is really okay. Oh, you know, I want StarCraft to, oh, I have to download another software and make another account just for one game. Yes, this game is working, but uh, every time, yeah, next time, next time, next time, I have so many games to play, so yeah, next time, next time, and next time becomes like, now. Of course, now I have four fucking games. I'm, I'm playing right now. The Last of Us, Record Council, Digimon, and Michael Gora. So, if I have time for something else I will do it but yeah I don't like to have so many games to play at the same time because I know I'm a lazy person I have a job uh, so maybe if I finish the last part I was about abandon the last of us but abandon uh, the last of us like very good story I, I love games with good story I can find them good stories similar okay girl I need this game I love it. And Digimon. Because I want to play it with my friends. So yeah, I will be like lazying up a little bit. So I was thinking about a schedule that makes sense to me. Like one episode a week for The Last of Us. Uh, one episode in a week for Rakakan's there. One episode in a week for Digimon. 14 episodes in a week for Kagura. I play this game twice every day. I have a problem. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm doing this for fun, so I'm going to get a fun schedule. When I want to play a game, I will play the game. So, if uh, any game in this list like interests you uh, to see uh, this uh, channel, Tell me and I'll play it. I want to see what people want. So, this is the Gaming Dreamer signing out. Goodbye.